This is a $9 million mansion with a private wraparound pool, three master bedrooms, and beautiful views, and we are about to tour the entire thing right now, so let's get into it. So here we are at the front of this gated Mediterranean compound. You have private gated access over into your guest property on my right. And on my left, you have private gated access into your main property. Amazing landscaping situated all throughout the property, as you can see. And you have this customized wooden door as a pedestrian gate, further taking you up into this stairwell, which leads you up into your grand entry. And before you even enter the property, I mean, just take a look on my right, you have this spacious seating area. You come through this section and you have another seating area. So when you first walk up to the property, you essentially just have straight on access into your backyard. You're hit head on with the panoramic views of Royal Oaks here in Encino, California. Of course, as I said, beautiful landscaping all throughout, Mediterranean architecture, home was built by Berkus Development, and also a huge thank you to Kevin and Brian Payne for allowing us to do this tour for them. You can find all of their information down in the description of this video. Take a look at this very detailed front door, and let's head inside. All right, so we have just made it inside, and the first detail I wanna show you, as I said, it's a very detailed front door, and you can actually close it up and open this little glass panel to let in tons of fresh air without compromising your security, which I think is a nice feature to have. Now, upon entering this property, we have a very open concept floor plan. You first enter and you have these ceilings, which have gotta be over 20 feet tall. Light fixture suspended in the center of this entry. Raw iron railing takes you up to level two. You have these interior pillar designs shown as well, which is an amazing addition. Adds a lot of character to this property, complemented well with these hardwood floors situated all throughout. Further on, we have porcelainosa floors, but we'll see that in just a bit. I wanna to talk to you all about this living space upon entering. Picture windows situated on either side of your beautiful fireplace with hand-carved stone details all around that section, paired well with wall sconces. Something else I also wanted to show you too, they have nicely staged a piano in front of this picture window. So just imagine, you could be playing piano, looking out at the views. I mean, that's pretty cool to have, right? Now let's continue our tour through this section. As I said, very open concept floor plan. I can see straight down into my modern kitchen, into my dining space, and over into my informal dining space. Should I mention also, you have plenty of outdoor access points too. Upon entering, you already have at least three to get out to that backyard space. Now, you can sit up to six of your guests here at your informal dining table. Of course, you're complimented by the gorgeous views of your pool. And this was that porcelainosa flooring that I was talking to you about all a little bit earlier. It looks like wood right here in the middle, but this is actually part of the tiling, completely porcelain. Now let's continue our tour through this section and we have access into your informal living area. You can see that they have kind of staged it as a little screening room, custom crown molding details all throughout. And the crown molding up above is actually shown in more of a natural wooden tone, which I think complements the space very well. Now over here, we have access into your full size bathroom space. You've got a floating vanity upon entering this space. And I also wanna show you this glass panel door to go into your shower. So it's actually a pivot door, which is really cool. We don't see this too often in uh, most of these walk-in shower spaces. You have three rain heads inside of the space vertical tiling displayed all throughout the section. One more thing I also wanna talk about, the transition into these floors over here in the bathroom, I think look absolutely gorgeous. Really nice custom designs over here on the tiles. Nice to have. And then you also have another little art installation over there on the right side of the room. Now let's take a turn back down through this section. And over here on my right hand side, you can see that this space is gonna lead us over into the kitchen area. But before we talk about the interior of that kitchen, we have this built-in breakfast nook seating space. You can sit about five to six people in here, comfortable lounge seating, of course, looking out to the gorgeous views. 
Now, continuing our tour through this side of the kitchen, you can see we've got your oversized center island upon entering the space with tons of custom cabinetry all throughout. Nice, smooth closing cabinetry. This specific section of the countertop is gonna be marble, and then on the far side, it's a butcher block. So you can essentially be cutting fruits and vegetables on your very own countertop, which I think is a nice feature to have. You've got this nice glass panel layered on top of the marble here in the center of the space. We have Viking appliances shown all throughout the kitchen area. And something else I wanted to show you too, you can open up these glass paneled cabinet doors and they actually all have their very own LED light inside too. So these can be illuminated throughout the entire day if you like. You also have your very own LED strip lights located under all of the cabinetry. So as I said, your kitchen could be light and bright all day long. You've got marble countertops complemented with the same marble backsplash. It looks very nice, clean, and modern in here. You've got your stainless steel dishwasher space next to your farm style sink area. While you're washing dishes, you're getting views out into your private backyard space and your colorful foliage, which is always cool to have. Continuing through more custom cabinetry, glass paneled up here as well. And if we take a turn over here on my right, you can see that we've got your six burner stove top designed by Viking, double oven setup situated right below that. You also have your own grill right over here on this section, which is pretty cool. LED lights above, more marble backsplash, layering this entire side of the kitchen area built-in microwave area, and this was the butcher block that I was talking to you all about a little bit earlier. Imagine just prepping your food on your very own countertop and then throwing it in the oven. I mean, it's pretty cool, pretty rare to have. I don't see it too often. And then also right here, you've got your Viking designed refrigeration space. I actually wanna show you this detail really quickly. This was pretty interesting. So this is the built-in camera system at the property and it actually has facial recognition. So your security system can actually send a text to your app and tell you if JP is coming home or if anyone else is coming home. And if it's a stranger, it'll also let you know. Pretty modern technology. Haven't seen that before in most homes. So I thought it was definitely essential to mention that. Now, one more little detail I want to talk about right over here. Next to your oven space, you've got built-in spice storage on either side. I see that usually in model homes, not too often in other residential homes, but I'm glad they added that. And of course, you got another one right here too, of course. Super essential to have. And let's continue our tour down over on my right-hand side, and we have your formal dining room, which can sit up to five of your guests. More crown molding details lining the perimeter of this space. As I mentioned in the beginning of the video, this is that outdoor access, which takes you into the front yard seating area where you have views of your private street and all of the foliage over there in the distance. Now, next to the space, we actually have another bathroom. This is gonna be a half bathroom. First coming in, let's talk about this custom cabinetry for a second. It's actually kind of like the front door, but you have these kind of metal wire details, very rustic, kind of like Viking design. I think that looks really amazing in my opinion. Of course, you've got the modern vessel sink mounted on top of this cabinetry. Wall sconces on either side of your rustic style mirror, and they've actually painted the door and the walls in the exact same color as the crown molding details up above this area, and actually for the rest of the property. So. I like how they kept that consistent coloring all throughout. Now let's continue our tour out through here. Also, I wanted to mention beautiful shaded light fixture above your dining table. You've got one pantry here and another pantry over on my left, but I actually want to continue our tour through this section right over here. We got a continuation of the porcelainosa floors. This door takes you into your garage area and continuing our tour. We've got backyard access right over here. Stick around, we'll see it in just a second. And this space takes us into a room that is currently being utilized as a gym right now. This could also be a bedroom or a private office if you like. We'll see more of the crown molding details lining the perimeter of this space. We've got access into a full-size bathroom with a floating vanity and a glass-enclosed walk-in shower space. And then next to this, got your little walk-in closet area. So overall, checks all the boxes. And that is pretty much gonna wrap up our tour of this entire first level. So now we have to head outside to the backyard, check that out, then the guest home, then the upper floor. So we still got a lot to see, let's do it right now. So 
here we are at the Backyard Oasis. As I mentioned in the beginning, you've got this stunning wraparound pool which goes all the way down into the guest property. And right next to the guest property, that's where you have access into the private hot tub area, which we will be seeing in just a bit. This is really cool. I mean, I've never really seen a pool quite like this one. It's completely infinity edge. And while you're relaxing in there, of course, you're hit with the jetliner views of Royal Hills here in Encino. And another portion of this pool I want to talk about, if you look right over there, you have underwater bar seating for up to four of your guests right here. How cool is that? And then right over here, you've got a fire pit and you've got another one down there, which we'll see in just a second. And also, let's talk about the seating sections all throughout. I mean, you've got two, you've got four massive seating areas. And then you have this private dining table surrounded by glass panels to give you that modern feel. And of course, it's overlooking the gorgeous foliage views of Royal Hills here in Encino, California. And this backyard has extreme privacy. As you can see, no neighbors are above you to be looking down into your property. Of course, just take a look at the colorful landscaping all throughout. This looks truly, truly gorgeous. And something else I did want to show you right over here really quick. Take a look at the views of your Mediterranean architecture from this point alone. This is absolutely stunning. Beautiful tiled section over there on the infinity edge side of the pool. I would love to just relax here have a drink or two with the friends. I mean, this is seriously really cool. Let's continue our tour through this section. The backyard is pretty large because this is a 17,500 square foot lot. So you've got plenty of outdoor space. You've got bar seating here for up to four of your guests, built-in refrigeration, built-in barbecue, and last but not least, stone pizza oven pretty amazing to have and then of course this turf area just stretches all the way back here if you've got kids if you've got dogs any kind of animal just let them run around free here beautiful seating sections as well palm trees colorful landscaping and then you have this impressive art installation just mounted here in your backyard pretty amazing to have now that pretty much wraps up our tour of the entire backyard but as i mentioned we still have to check out that guest house so let's do it right now Something that makes this property super special is the fact that you've got a fully self-sufficient guest house. It's got a backup generator. It's got a full kitchen. It's got laundry. It's got three bathrooms. You have a bathroom downstairs in the garage, which we've converted to an art studio. Could be perfect for an office. Could be great for a musician. On the main level, you've got a bathroom here. You've got your own laundry upstairs. You've got the great views, double-sided fireplace. I've had people that have like, can I just come and live in the guest house? It has it all. It really it, it, does. It really does. I mean, you got an oven, stovetop, microwave. It's seriously yeah. everything you possibly need. And then you come up the stairs right here, and then it takes you into what looks like just another primary bedroom suite. Yes. And the more amazing views yeah. of Encino. And you got the vaulted ceilings, too, in the guest house, which is, Tell I think, me you pretty awesome. You wouldn't be happy in so, I mean, this is all I would ever need. This is perfect. And I could live with several people here, too, and still yeah. be very comfortable, which I think is amazing. Your views private it's balcony really I mean seriously you've got it all and then let's take a look at the bathroom yeah really quick too still great finishes all throughout I mean it's seriously everything you could possibly need absolutely me all right so another thing I wanted to point out to you is as we walk through the house you know you're gonna find little things like this the owner really capitalized on all different types of areas throughout the house so you've got all these little nooks and crannies areas to sit areas to hang out Everything is custom, all the woodwork. Come on up, we'll finish. I want to show you up here. So something that makes Royal Hills super unique is three of the four bedrooms upstairs are primary suites. So they've got fireplaces, balconies, unbelievable picturesque windows. Vaulted ceilings. I mean, you wake up to that view it's, every day. It's all here, It's man. stunning, yeah, And then exactly. the bathrooms, I mean, every bathroom in the house is different, so it's super cool. This one, you have stone. You've got kind of the Balinese feel. He used pivot doors on the showers, which is super unique. I love unique. that, that's amazing. Yeah, something that you really don't see. Yeah, amazing. And then talk about this woodwork for a second. I've never really seen this type of detail. You know, they're that's collectors. Amazing. Yeah. So they pull things from all over the place. This yeah. was something that they got on a vacation somewhere. Steve is an, he's an artist at heart and his company, Burkus Development, I mean, these are the little touches that he does in all of his homes. They're always gonna be with unique features. He's not your cookie cutter, in anything that he does. Now let's continue our tour outside of the first 
primary bedroom suite. Again, we have literally three to check out, which is pretty cool. And then I wanted to mention this too, this open atrium design as you first enter the property, amazing rustic light fixture suspended in the center of this section. You got a little drop ceiling detail, crown molding is lining the perimeter of this space. And if we take a turn over to my left-hand side, we actually have double door access, further taking us into primary bedroom number two. And before you get into the bedroom portion of the room, you actually have this kind of living space section with, again, extremely high vaulted ceilings with wooden beam details, built-in ceiling fan, mounted flat screen TV, amazing staging. And also you have one closet, but you have another one in there too, which we'll see in just a second. We're coming through, beautiful bedroom space. Again, amazing staging throughout, vaulted ceiling with the wooden beam details, another built-in ceiling fan, massive mounted flat screen TV, and you also have a double-sided fireplace. And something else I wanna show you, you have this nice little nook shelving, glass paneled all throughout, looks beautiful. And then we continue our tour through this section. We have a balcony, just like the last one that we saw. You come out to the absolutely amazing views of Royal Oaks here in Encino, California. And something else that I wanna talk about too, this detail right here. So this is actually the rain gutter up above and it drops the water into this artistic looking little assembly down into the backyard. And you're gonna see those throughout the rest of the roof lines of the property. Pretty cool, I mean, I don't really see that very often in most homes, thought that was something cool to mention. And we continue our tour back inside. You've got this double door access with these integrated glass panels further taking you into the primary bathroom suite. Look at the tiling displayed on the floor right over here. Super unique, artistic, really cool to have. Everything in this property is super customized. And then also we have the other side of the fireplace right here. Open this up and we have your water closet and get a close up on these door handles really quickly. Really unique, transparent design compared well with the matte black. Pretty awesome. And then you have actually another water closet right here natural wooden tones on the door. You've got a double vanity setup. It's floating off the ground and all of the cabinetry is of course soft closing. Gotta have it. Massive mounted mirror. You've got the freestanding tub. You got views of Royal Oaks here in Encino. I mean, I can go on and on about this bathroom. You have so many little details throughout. And the other detail I wanna show you, first of all, you got the glass pivot door taking you into your walk-in shower space, but look inside of the shower for just a second. So. You have not one, not two, you have three rain heads mounted up above me. You have four body sprays on this side of the shower, and then you actually have another handheld body spray inside of here. So you essentially have like eight different places for water to come out. And then also you can adjust these rain heads as well. Just turning these knobs right here. I mean, that's really, really cool to have. But I don't wanna to spend too much time in here. I wanna continue our tour outside of this section. Also right here, You've got your walk-in closet space, extremely spacious, full body mirror, glass shelving. It literally goes super far back. I mean, seriously. Floor to ceiling storage. And this is just one of three primaries. I mean, pretty crazy. Let's continue our tour though. Follow me out through this section. Now we are back up at the landing at the second floor. Follow me down through here. We've got your washer dryer situated inside of there. And let's continue our tour through this space. And here we are, we are at the third and the final primary suite. You have a Juliet balcony situated on this side of the room. Let me show you really quickly. So of course you get views out into your private street. You can have a couple plants out here, getting that sunlight. I mean, this is just absolutely beautiful. Foliage in the distance. And then you also have beautiful views right in front of me outside of that other little picture window. Now situated on my left, we have the primary closet currently under storage. So out of the respect of the owner's privacy, we're not going to go in there, but we can take you inside of the third primary bathroom up here on the second floor. First coming in again, we've got another one of these glass panel pivot doors. I mean, seriously, how cool is that? Stone details situated all throughout the space floor to ceiling. They're even clad up above on the ceiling if you see that up there. You got integrated bench seating. You've got two rain heads inside of here, completely glass enclosed, true luxury. And then also we've got a double vanity set up with marble countertops. You also have a little private vanity area. Maybe you need to get ready before the basketball game or your golf tournament. This is exactly where you could do it. And then you have another freestanding tub inside of the section with another little light fixture above. I mean, seriously, every detail customized, completely thought through, more beautiful views of the foliage. Absolutely incredible. 
And that is pretty much going to wrap up our tour of this entire property here in Royal Hills, Encino, California. Please make sure to drop a like, subscribe, comment down below if you haven't already. Thank you to Kevin Payne for allowing us to do this tour for him. Also, a huge thank you to the developer as well. You can find all of his info down in the description of this video, and I'll see you next time.